So welcome back to Open World Forum 2011. Uh, you are in Italian TV. We're here with Louis Montagne, uh, co-president of uh, Open World Forum 2011 of this edition. Welcome, Louis. Thank you. Thanks for being here. So uh, how was Open World Forum 2011? What's your takeaway for this edition? So um, this edition was um, really interesting. It was uh, more than 2,000 2, people attending, so it's a lot. And uh, they did sync code and experiment as we expected and as we built the program. Um, there were more than uh, 125 hours of conferences, that's a lot. Um, we, uh, we had like uh, 30 different speakers on stage uh, on keynotes. Uh, so that was dense, really. There, there, there has been a lot of business. Um, a lot of uh, people coming to learn code and stuff and also uh, we were really surprised to have a lot of people coming on the third day um, like mainstream users uh, coming just to discover open source so yeah, the third day is mostly about the public right so it's yeah right the, the third day is um, is um, the experiment day um, so it's uh, much more open to the to, to the public so um, Anyone can come and discover like uh, robots that you can control using your Android phone or a 3D printer that you can build uh, at home yourself. Um, really interesting stuff, actually. So, and uh, what would you say are some of the major challenges you've gone through with uh, OWF? I'd say like simple pragmatical challenges. The, the first one um, would be Like the the program was really dense, so um, we had the, all the keynotes and the panels uh, in the auditorium, uh, but we also had so many summits, and the, this was really a challenge to to make sure that everyone gets an audience. Um, so that was a challenge, and we succeeded pretty well on that. Um, so you think that the the tracks think code experiment this was the the right breaking down into categories. Yeah, and, and I think that's that's part of the second challenge I see is that uh, for me Open World Forum was a little bit disconnected. Uh, the last three editions, it was really focused on business, which is really good and which is really important for Open World Forum. That's the core of it. But still, it, it must not be disconnected. So we needed to, to reconnect it to the developers and we also needed to reconnect it to the, to the public um, so having these three moments, three threads, uh, uh, think code and experiment, that was the way we thought about to reconnect that. And the interesting fact is that uh, it mixed correctly because it had to mix. Uh, uh, it, it last, um, the event lasted three days. Uh, and the two first days were on uh, think and the, the two last days were code. So think and code crowds so basically said the ties and the t-shirts mixed during the second day. So, uh, and that was really interesting because some ties went to some t-shirts conferences and vice versa. And that was really interesting. Oh, that's a good mix. Well, so if we have all the, it was success having all these three, uh, do you think there's anything left that could be improved for uh, next editions or something that, that could be added? Sure, there's, there's, there's always a lot to improve. Um, I think we can improve our communication on the program because that was a challenge and uh, there's a lot we can do about that because the program is too dense and not clear enough. So there's a lot we can do on that. Um, there's What's lying ahead like for next editions of OWF? I cannot tell too much because, um, because I don't want to tell too much and I'm not the one that will be uh, choosing all the subjects for next year. Uh, but still, uh, I think we have to work on um, some subjects like politics, how to integrate that into um, our program. Um, like, uh, globally speaking, women in tech, because uh, we need to be, to be more attractive to women in our businesses, um, because the, the parity is not good. Um, and and how, how much do you think we have gone actually with women in tech on this edition of OWF? How successful? has OWF been this time around on this subject? I think we were pretty good, actually. Um, we, had, uh, we had a few uh, keynote speakers uh, that were women and that were really good. Um, 
We also had a few uh, speakers in the summits, and some of the summits were organized by, by women, so that's really interesting. Uh, so the, the parity was almost there, but when you count, when you go to the website and count the, the and look at the speakers, uh, like 300 speakers or more, uh, and especially as there are um, code uh, specific speakers listed there, um, you find a lot of men. Because uh, especially in the, in the code sections, you don't have that many women. And, and I think that's something that we, we need to work on because um, even in the schools uh, today, um, if you take a, uh, an engineering school in France uh, that is dedicated to computer science, uh, you get like 5% of women. So, so, so that's, that's really not enough. So uh, a big focus on the next edition will be to, uh, to bring more women. Yeah, that's going to be uh, one of the big focuses. Uh, the, the other one will be uh, to get in the politics. And I think we have so many to, to see. Like, um, um, one of the focuses I see is uh, also connecting more to the communities and having more um, events like we had this year with the OSDC, uh, the Open Source Developers Conference, um, having more um, community events. Like if we can get um, events for projects, I don't know, like the LibreOffice event connected to Open World Forum, or uh, I don't know, like the Debian guy coming. I don't know, there, there's a lot to do on that. And I mean, you mentioned politics, so uh, where do you draw, draw the line? I mean, what's the importance of politics when it comes to open source? It's, I, I don't know if it's not the other way around, actually. Um, politics is always important for everything. Uh, but I think today that probably open source is important for politics because open source is about a lot of subjects and uh, it's about freedom, it's free software so, uh, so it's, it's, it's really important for all the people of a state so it's really important for politics um, and so I think yeah, th there are a lot of subjects that, that we will discuss upon next year well thank you very much for your time Wish you all the success for next editions in uh, Open World Forum. Yeah, the, the next edition uh, will be uh, still Sync Code and Experiment, and it's going to be on the 27th of September um, in 2012. So I hope you will come join us for the, the fifth edition of the Open World Forum. Well, you heard him, 27th September next year, so see you all there. And uh, see you soon on Italian TV. Thank you. Thank you.